What's going on, Internet? It is your boy, Eric Banholtz, back again with another awesome episode from Urban Beardsman. Today, we're talking about why I'm so skinny. Here I am. Your trusty beardsman in all my skinny glory. Since I've zoomed out with my camera, I've noticed a few more comments about my body build. Well, I'm skinny because I like being skinny. I've always been skinny. And frankly, I got no problem with it. I got no problems when I look in the mirror. I don't wish my body was any different than it is. I like who I am. That's cool. Just like I like having a beard. I like changing my hair up and I like dressing cool. So rather than having a short video, I figured I'd talk a little bit about why I choose to be skinny and maybe a little bit of my history with my body. So I'm six foot five, I'm 175 pounds, and I've always been athletic to some degree. Now I'm not going to say I was a good athlete, but I've been athletic. I've played sports, swimming all my life, golf, tennis, baseball. Geez, cross country in high school. 1998 Greenville County JV cross country champion. And in college, I was the captain of my crew team. The heaviest I've ever gotten in my entire life was 195 pounds in college. And that was when I was rowing. But I could not eat enough food to gain weight. Literally, the calories I was putting out was just getting consumed. And I enjoy eating, but... I don't love eating, like it's not a passion of mine. And you'll see in a previous video where I talk about Soylent, how it makes eating a lot more convenient. So for me, a guy of my height, I'm gonna need to eat a ton of calories to maintain muscle weight and to put on more muscle. Specifically, what does that mean? It means I'm gonna have to eat about 800 more calories a day to be at a muscular 215 pounds. To put that into perspective, I would have to eat an entire chicken every single day. Now I'm no PETA member, but killing a bird every single day just so I can look a little bit better seems kind of wasteful to me. In fact, you got to think about that. Like the more food you consume, the more calories you take in, that's the more resources that you need to take from society. And if you're not generating that type of energy for a good cause, then it's all for waste. Now I'm married, I've got a kid, a family, I've got a business. You know, my type priorities in life right now are spending time with my family, they're spending time on my business, trying to grow the business, spending time creating these videos. So for me, my exercise routines aren't about necessarily looking good to impress other people, it's about being healthy so I can function very productively at work have the energy for my family, and then of course live a long time so that I can make more of an impact on the world. Because you're curious, you probably want to know what I do. I subscribe to this program called CEO Strength, and it's basically a workout routine that's built around body weight workouts or calisthenics. It's a lot of planking, a lot of push-ups, a lot of sit-ups, and it's great because I travel all over the world and I don't have time to find a gym everywhere. I don't have time to go to the gym, but I want to be healthy. So the most equipment that I need is generally like a table to do some incline push-ups, uh, some bands to get a little bit of resistance, and a jump rope so I can do that uh, if it's raining out. And with that, I'm getting all the strength that I need, all the health that I need from a simple program that can work within my routine. And that's what your body type and your health and all that, your appearance, your style, everything is about. It's about you and your life and how it fits into your life. It's not about seeing someone say something about you and then making a change. It's about being confident and comfortable with who you are and then doing the things that are necessary to maintain that. And if you're not currently the person who you wanna be, then taking the steps to get you in the direction that you wanna go. Because there's nothing wrong with being a muscular guy. And that's a pretty cool thing for guys that are into that. 
but you don't want to put on muscle and build yourself out because you're trying to impress others. You want to do it because it's something that you want internally and something that you find value for. So one more thing before I leave, shameless plug, we got new products from Beard Brand. It's a solid cologne. So now not only am I skinny, I'm a smelling good skinny. As always, thanks for watching. Cheers. Beard on.